So here at Texas Relays, how did it feel getting out there, getting your, I guess, your feet wet starting the outdoor season? Um, it felt really good, you know. But a lot, well, a lot of people don't know that I haven't ran second leg since high school. So I was very excited to finally run second leg again. Been maybe like five or six years, you know, because at USC, as soon as I got there, I stepped last leg, world team last leg. So it was great to have a different feeling running on second leg. What, how do you guys decide about putting together this relay? It's a, a unique situation. There's obviously not major stakes, but like it's here kind of fun, but you also want to run well. And Yeah, so um, originally I think they wanted me to be to, for us to rerun the, um, the world team that we ran at the World Championship, but I went to run with Star Athletics with my team, you know, because not often do we get to line up on a relay, you know, and this was our, uh, like our set opportunity. So I went to run with Star Athletics, but we knew it was gonna be some great competition. So it was just fun to just go out there and have other ladies to line up against and have fun out there. What do you get out of this meet? Uh, obviously the ultimate goal is make a team down in July and run at Worlds in August, but what do you get out of a, a March, April relay? Um, for me, you know, you get to see where you at. Um, you starting to see all the work that you put in and practice. And like you said, getting your feet wet, going out there having fun, making some little errors that you know you have to fix later down the line when it actually counts. So you're just getting, just getting a feel of things, I would say. What are you focusing on this year compared to previous seasons? Every year I'm just focusing on having fun and being technically better than the year before. So fun is always number one. Yes, definitely, because once you stop having fun with it, it's over with. It's a good point. Yes. When did you learn that? That you like that the um, being comfortable. I kind of yeah. learned that a while ago, but I definitely learned that SC with Coach Carroll. Um, because instead of like putting like being one of the top athletes, you know, you tend to put pressure on yourself, stress on yourself for no reason, um, to try to live up to the hype of the media, but other folks' expectations. So Coach Carroll always would tell me like, "You ready to run? Just go out there, BTT, and have fun. And as long as I stick to that and have fun with it, everything else falls in place." When's the next race? Uh, next week, April 8th, season opener at Myanmar. Okay, well, good luck. Thank you. Thanks a lot.